Hi, my name is Paul from Rotterdam, the Netherlands. Um, it seems a good idea to take an old and trusted success product off the shelves, dust it off, restyle it and milk it again. Luckily, it's not quite that easy, nor is it often a very successful approach. There are exceptions, however, in the year 2000, meaning succeeded in restyling a car that evokes strong emotions and making it ready for the future. When Mini's head of brand communication cancelled two days before the interview, I feared that already by week three, my plan to do one interview a week for 20 uninterrupted weeks was going to Ari. It took me a lot of um, convincing to arrange an interview with Gerd Hildebrand, head of design at Mini. Instead, I spoke with him under the watchful eye of BMW Group, PR lady in the highly secure, no picture please, design department in the industrial zone just outside of Munich. In the fall of 1959, 50-year-old, yet to be knighted, Alec Isajonis, designer and technical engineer at British Motor Corporation, laid the basis for the first design of the Mini and series of sketches. 